What's up everybody, welcome to the 5150 Gringo Garage and today we're going to be doing an Amazon cool gadget video. I've done a couple in the past, but anyways, this is going to be a, a headlamp. This is by Mikoz. Um, let me show you how you spell that. It is M-E-Q-O-Z-E. -E. And this is going to be a pretty cool little headlamp because I have this one from Harbor Freight. Um, this is the Quantum. I did a review on this one, which is a pretty powerful um, little headlamp, uh, which works really good. This one just goes on. It has, you know, your LED right in the middle with a few different modes. Uh, it's just one big LED. All right, guys, so this is the headlamp that I got. This is a Cobb Plus LED rechargeable sensor headlamp. All right, guys, so a few specs on this um, headlamp is, let's go over all the features. It does have the Cobb lighting, which is the chip on board with all those super bright, tiny LEDs that use very little energy. You do have the one bright LED that goes in uh, here. Um, this thing also is 1300 lumens if you guys want to know it does have a 230 degree cob lighting So you're gonna be able to see basically everything in front of you um, I don't know if I said but it's rechargeable motion sensor lightweight man this thing look check it out You can literally just roll it on up and it's super small And you also have your buttons on the side you got your power and your um, motion sensor button here and on the back, you do have a charging port, which this one is going to be a, a USB Type-C, which comes in the package. But for now, we are good to go. Like I said, this thing is an adjustable headband, which feels actually pretty nice. You know, like I said, it just sits right against the forehead. It doesn't protrude, you know, a few inches like this one, which makes it nice. Get up under the car, do your thing. Or it's just more comfortable in general. It doesn't weigh as much. It almost feels like there's nothing there. Let's go ahead, we're gonna hit the button once. There's five modes, by the way. So you got your mode one, which is, let me find the button. See, this is why they got the, the sensor on the side. Oh, there's your bright um, cob lights, then your dimmer cob lights, then you got your bright LED, uh, more dim LED, and then, of course, on the side, we'll go ahead and hit this button here. Let's turn it on first. And now you see that changed. Now it is in sensor mode. Let's see how far you gotta be. So you can't be this far, you have to be. So if you're running past things or you're moving around, it's not gonna pick up, you know, something that's a you know more than like a foot away, you get a little closer, works just fine. Look at that. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and put these two lights on, turn all the lights off because it's super, I mean, it's pitch black when I turn them off. And we're going to see how much brighter or better the, the cob slash LED is compared to just the single LED. So let's go ahead and do that now. Let's go ahead and turn the garage lights off. All right. So cob bright, cob dim. Here is your spotlight or your LED, and this is your LED dim. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and try the Quantum. All right guys, so here's the Quantum. I mean, it's super bright, but you only get that little bit of, you know, view right there. I mean, it's whatever you're looking at, that's what's bright. So you got these modes. So let's go ahead and we're gonna go back to And here is the cob lighting. So now you can see, you get to see kind of everything in the garage looking good. So it's super bright. So here's your spotlight and here's your quantum light. Let's move this camera out of the way. So I mean, that's pretty equal comparison right there. Of course, the Quantum does open up a little bigger, but they aren't much different in, in brightness, as you can see. All right, guys, so the, what I really love about this is how it just fits flat against your head. It almost weighs nothing, it's like, I, I can't even tell you what it weighs. It's, it's, it's literally like nothing. Um, 
And when you're using a headlamp like this one, when you're up in the attic or doing whatever, you literally have to like keep moving it and you have to like look around and you're trying to get your light up there and doing all this weird stuff to get that spotlight right on it. But with the cob lighting, it lights everything up so you can see everything without having to look in that direction, which is nice. I really like this headlamp. I recommend you guys get you one. Um, right now, I think they're 20 bucks, but from what I was told, there's gonna be two to three people that like this video and comment that will get a free uh, headlamp sent to you. Uh, also, if you guys need like a 30% off coupon, I'll try to get that for you. I'll put the link in the description on this video, but check it out, easy. It, just store it, it's, you can literally just put it in your fist. Then you got your normal headlamp, it's, you know, it's big, hefty. I mean, this thing's just neat. It's a neat little gadget. Uh, super good to have around the house. You're going to be crawling up in the attic. You're going to be under working on the sink. Or you're going to be, you know, working on the car. Or doing anything. Going out for a jog at night. This thing is super bright. You know, check it out. Awesome. Awesome. Really happy with it. You know, like I said, go check out the link in the description. Get you one on Amazon. Like this video if you haven't. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't because I mean like a few more subscribers we're gonna be at 10,000 subscribers and maybe I'll do a giveaway uh, for what I don't know just give me some ideas on what I should do but anyways thanks for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one